Yeah, I think if you're if you're that interested in farming, you're probably out on the farm, not sitting at home. When it comes to Wonder Kids on the new FIFA, I could stand here and talk about Donnarumma, Gabriel Jesus, Kylian Mbappe, and Ousmane Dembele. But it's slightly difficult to go unnoticed in the footballing world when you command a transfer fee of over 150 million pounds. So instead, I'm going to give you the insider tip on some lesser-known FIFA players who will cost you less than 10 million a piece. First up, we start in between the sticks with a goalkeeper whose potential rating is a huge improvement on his starting rating. Bartek Drangowski could go from a lowly 71 rating to a massive 86, but provided he gets the right amount of game time. His first season at Fiorentina after his move from home country Poland saw him play third choice backup to most of the goalkeepers. That, combined with the fact he's only around five million pounds means he'd be an easy transfer target and someone who would definitely sign for you. Our first outfield player on the list is a defender and someone whose on-pitch maturity defies his age. At just age 18 and having been the second youngest debutant goalscorer in Ligue 1, Malang Saar is not only a French under-21 player but also captain the under-18 side as well as being a first-team starter at Club Nice. Built like the next Kurt Zuma, and with bags of potential, up to 88 in fact, he looks like an absolute steal for £9 million. If you're looking for a solid spine to your young team, this guy has to be in there. For this young Spanish midfielder, it's not just FIFA who rate him highly, at 87, but his club Barcelona do as well. Currently in the B team, but having made a goal-scoring debut appearance in the Copa del Rey last season, Carlos Alenia has a new contract with £75 million buyout clause in it. But how do you sign him, I hear you ask? Well, it seems that the inflated buyout clause is really just a fullback option for Barcelona in case he does become the next Andres Iniesta. For the moment, you can sign him for just £6.2 million. But if you do, just in case he does become a great, be sure to insert a nice big buyback clause for Barcelona. That will really show him. In Ezequiel Barco, Argentinian giants Independiente have a real gem on their hands. With the potential to reach a massive 90 rating, there's no wonder that some of Europe's biggest clubs have been keeping an eye on his progress. He's a lightning quick winger with fantastic ball control and excellent dribbling. Something you come to expect of a new South American prospect. But how much would it cost you to lure him to your team? About £7 million should do the trick. And talking of tricks, his four-star skill moves aren't too bad either. Next up is another French youngster whose footballing ability could see him rise to superstardom in the footballing galaxy. Toulouse are known for producing talented footballers, so Kelvin Amiant Adu will be eager to follow in the footsteps of players like Moussa Sissoko, Etienne Capou and Philippe Mexes into the top level of the game for club and country. His one season in professional football so far has seen him move into the France under-21 squad as well as claim a right-back starting place for Toulouse. Either FIFA have overestimated his potential or the in-game Toulouse board don't really rate him that highly. But either way, for 6.3 million, you could have an exceptional right-back on your hands. Now here's another player off the seemingly never-ending product line at Ajax. His technical ability alongside his physical prowess give him all the skills to be a real threat anywhere across the front line. I wonder where 18-year-old Justin Clivert got all his ability from. Well, it probably helps when this guy is your dad. Ajax have tied Justin down for quite a long-term contract, but they're willing to let him go for around £6 million. That's definitely worth a punt. We now come on to the cheapest player on this list, but only because his starting rating is a lowly 70. Should you want to snap up a young centre midfielder with bags of ability for only two and a half million pounds, then Cagliari's Nico Barella is your guy. He's incredibly nimble and agile in the middle of the park, and with some amazing technical abilities, it's a really small outlay for someone who could reach 86. Now this may seem like a trick player that we've thrown in there, because he starts in the first team of one of the biggest clubs in the world, PSG. You'd probably be foolish for thinking that he'd want to leave a club with such stature. But Giovanni Lo Celso has an insane amount of competition in the PSG midfield, meaning he'd definitely be open for a move, 
should you provide the 9.5 million pounds that the Parisian club are demanding for him. For a guy who's got a potential rating of 86, it looks like a pretty good investment considering he's only 21, but has a load of top level experience under his belt. He's six foot one with two great feet, fantastic ball control, and passing ability to challenge any. Oh, and he wears the red and black of AC Milan. No, this isn't an early 2000s throwback to Andrea Perlo, but it might as well just be the next best thing. If you're looking for a midfield maestro to dictate the game, look no further than Manuel Locatelli. In a footballing world where high money and high profile signings are trusted over youth, why not spend the nine million pounds on someone who at 19 literally has the world at his feet? With a starting rating of 72, but a potential rating of 88, the last player on this list is someone you must get your hands on quickly should Atletico Madrid's real life interest be transferred over into the game. A strong and quick forward with excellent finishing, not too dissimilar in stature to Sergio Aguero, Lautaro Martinez has caught the eye of some big European clubs, big European clubs, European clubs, with some fantastic performances for Racing Club de Avellaneda in his home country of Argentina. But to get him to sign on the dotted line might actually be easier than you think. With some strong performances in the Under-20 World Cup this summer, minus the red card, he'll set you back about five and a half million pounds albeit with a big wage on top. So there's our top 10 list of youngsters under 10 million. Who do you think will reach their potential and who do you think will flop? Let us know in the comments below and enjoy the game. He's six foot one with great footballing ability. Two amazing left feet. <laughs> Got two great left feet. <laughs>